Hi, this is Jeff August with another Speed Looks tutorial. And today we're talking about the new Speed Looks that are included now with the Adobe Creative Cloud that you can use in Speed Grade, Premiere Pro, and even After Effects. In this tutorial, I'm just going to show you where they're located and how you can get up and running with them really quickly. As you can see, I have a project loaded on my timeline. I'm going to just quickly pull a grading layer by hitting this button here, and now I've created a separate grading layer over top of there. All right, and now let's go to our Looks tab that has become available. Now, by hitting my Look tab, I, I do see in my Look browser a bunch of presets that were created by Adobe. Let's quickly navigate to our Speed Looks, and you'll actually see that they're located in the same folder as the Adobe examples. So if you go to Look Examples, you'll see Speed Looks Camera and Speed Looks Cine Looks. So let's choose Speed Looks Cine Looks right there. So there are our Speed Looks. And now let's choose another tab, the Cinematic tab, and now we'll choose our Camera Patches. And there are our camera patches. Now I encourage you all to watch other tutorials to see how to use and work with speed looks in speed grade, but I'll quickly just show you how I can apply and get a great, beautiful graded image with the free speed looks that are included. So this was shot on an Alexa camera, so let me apply the Alexa camera patch first. I'll just select it there and then hit enter so that it now is applied to the clip. And now let's go look at our cine looks. And I'm also going to just select the grading layer right above our, our, our track because we want to we want to put it on a separate grading layer. And now we can just punch through our speed looks and see which ones we like. So, for example, uh, gold tobacco. Let's just quickly dial it up. Let's uh, take a look at uh, a blue look really quickly. Blue intense. And you can see that they're amazing starts for grading to start happening. Um, in combination with AR camera patches and then our looks, people can start getting professionally graded looks instantly and definitely have creative, creative control after the fact. For example, we look at this shot and we can see that it's a little dark right now. So again, because we're color correcting underneath the LUT, all I would need to do is actually um, go to my primary color correction and we'll just lift the blacks up a bit. Let's just close this window so you can see what I'm doing. So don't uh, don't forget that even though you're using speed looks, you can still do all your regular color correction underneath the LUT and you'll maintain a beautiful, perfect palette every time. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Don't forget to check out our website, looklabs.net. There you'll find lots of tutorials and tips and tricks to get you up and running with speed looks right away. And we now have a special offer to all Adobe Creative Cloud users, the Speed Looks Adobe Complete Bundle. In this bundle, not only will you get more Speed Looks in Noir, Blue, and Gold, but you'll also receive Matrix, Big, and our flagship, Clean.